Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dean Harper Realtors. Once I'm again at the beautiful one acre lot community of Bell Oaks in Boverde, Texas. And I'm out here because the house behind me is almost ready to close. Not quite yet. We're looking at probably another week out, but I wanted to get this video in for my clients. But uh, it's built by Grand Endeavor, and this is a Jolie plan. Let's go check it out. All right, this house is on its last minute, and this does happen sometimes where um, it's a kind of a race to the finish. So they've got all hands on deck trying to get this house built. But we have a special guest with us today, Miss Ladina. She is a new agent with Coa Banker, so she's asked me to kind of show her what I do because she's going to follow in my footsteps and be amazing. So look forward to seeing her YouTube channel coming out soon. Thank you, Jason. <laughs> My pleasure. But yeah, this is a beautiful one acre lot community. There are tons of lots on the market right now. As I'm filming this, it is toward the end of July 2023. And so many people have bought lots out here and then changed their mind and put them back on the market. So, hey, if you're interested in the community, feel free to reach out to me. All right, let's head on inside and check out this absolutely gorgeous homes. There are workers here right now because like I said, they are on a push to get it done, but I definitely love the stone work that they've done on this house, the beautiful metal roof. And man, this entryway is really nice. This is such a beautiful entrance. Love the little glass they have on there. Plenty of space in, out here. Beautiful. Now this is the Jolie plan. The square footage is just over 3,000 square feet, but oh my gosh, my clients put all the bells and whistles into this house. They even, because Grand Endeavor is a semi-custom home, they were able to stretch this whole middle space about two feet. So this house might not look identical as other Jolie plans, but yeah, it is gorgeous. All right, coming right in front, you have your office space. <coughs> now, talking to my client just a second ago, and he does wish that when they did the stretch, they'd pull the walls a little bit close to the door on both sides, just to have given them a little more space uh, in the rooms versus the entryway. You're never gonna have a perfect home, but uh, if you're watching this, I want everybody to learn and do better because we all learn from each other. But this is a beautiful office. Love the glass French doors and the little view coming out the back. Real hardwood floor in here. You got the uh, power outlets, kind of set up for his own TV there. Super nice. Let's show off this kitchen. Love the color of the front of this uh, kitchen sink. And they've done some really interesting stuff that I really like a lot. Now I've never seen this before, but I really like it. You got the double stacked ovens but this oven's got the French doors on it. Okay, I think that's pretty darn cool. All right, like I said, they're still in the last minute rush to get everything done, so they're getting the gas hooked up right now. They do have a beautiful single basin sink. And check out the view from the sink here. Oh, they're super cool fancy lights up top. Really like that a lot and lots of space over on this side. This could be your formal dining room area, extra cabinet space. It's really nice. <clears throat> All right, let's walk down here, kind of look at this spot. This is our game room slash man cave. This is gonna be super cool and useful. Got a place for the wet bar back here in this corner and hooked up for every type of speaker device possible, including like Adobe sound, which is really nice, and your surround sound back here. It's gonna be a super cool room to come hang out in. And then you got this bathroom, beautifully done tile work. And let me show you something else here. This is super cool. I dig this. I've never seen this before. I, I saw the little blue light. I'm like, I gotta touch that. So I touched it. I was like, wow, that is super cool to have the lights coming on behind the mirror. I know. Small things entertain me. But that keeps my life happy. All right. And then you got this little bedroom stuck off in the back here, which does have access to that bathroom. So if you have your long-term guest, uh, 
They can have access to that bathroom, bedroom away from everybody, and still a really good sized closet. All right, I would, at this point, I normally would show off the outside, but man, we got a lot of workers going on out here. Um, <clears throat> they're finishing up some tile work, putting in a fire pit, but this is a one acre lot community. So they got it to where the sun going across the house, not the sun's not setting in back of them. Cause let me tell you, it's hot in Texas right now. I think it's hot pretty much everywhere, <clears throat> but he's got shade on the patio. Even at happy hour time, he's got plenty of shade, but He's got the wrought iron fence kind of separating where he want, would want to maintain the lawn. And then he's still got plenty of space back there that still is his, but he can keep it natural. And he's got a neat little uh, outdoor cooking area coming in. All right, this room's the master bedroom. I want to shave, save that for last, but he does have this lower linear fireplace, giving him more space to put a TV up top without breaking your neck. I love the built-ins. Those are super cool looking built-ins. All right, let's go check out this bedroom. Oh, he said tall ceilings, eight foot doors throughout. And this is gonna be the, the brains of the place. Got all the wiring set up. It's kind of a Jack and Jill bathroom set up where each room will have its own sink. It's got the little push buttons there too. And then they'll share the toilet and the bathtub. And beautiful tile work. Absolutely love the color of that tile. I don't know if it's as dark on the GoPro as it is in real life, but that is gorgeous. And then coming into this bedroom sink. So this is the, like the third bedroom. Like you said, just great light throughout this house. Some really modern fans and tall ceilings. Like I said, just a little tidbit of what Bell Oaks looks like out the side there. All right, let's go on and check out the master bedroom and we'll wrap up this video. But yeah, super tall ceilings in here. Does have the speakers already mounted in there. Got your tray ceiling. You got your ex your door going out to your pool area, hot tub, grill. I mean, it's gonna be just a huge entertainment space out there. I really like it a lot. But really check out this bathroom. Beautiful tile floor. And these lights have an even more cool feature. A little button here changes the LED lights on there. Super cool, I'm digging that. All right, I'm also digging this wall here, the little 3D uh, textured wall. There's actually some uh, depth to that. It's really nice. You got your little car wash shower with a towel going all the way up. We still have some water on the floor there. I guess they're working on this, but man, that's super cool. Dual shower heads with a wand and a bench. Very nice. And Grand Endeavor, they did let him bring in his own closet person to build out this closet. So I did a really good work. I actually asked uh, my client for the contact information for this guy. So in case anybody out there wants to reach out to him, he did this for a really nice price. So my client's very happy and glad that Grand Endeavor allowed him to do this versus their kind of standard closet. He definitely saved some money by doing it like this. Alrighty, there's Miss Ladea. Get one last big look at this house. And what I plan to do another video just before these guys close, just so you can see what the absolute finished product is. We're close, but we're not quite there yet. All right, that's gonna wrap the tour of the Jolie plan being built by Grand Endeavor in Bell Oaks. And I came out today hoping it was gonna be uh, closer than done to this, but never hesitate to do a video. 
But uh, I hope you liked this video and hope you uh, got some good information from it. If you did, please hit that like button. Of course, I want you to subscribe to my channel. And as always, share these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.